Hi, my name is Jackie, and I would like to welcome you to my channel if this is your first time here. I hope that you'll consider subscribing if you enjoyed today's video. And for my returning subscribers, I'm always happy to have you back. So in today's video, I thought I would do a shop my stash for my skincare products. You know, I haven't been in including skincare in my videos, but I've kind of been slacking with my skincare and have had some things develop. So I thought I should go ahead and jump back into my skincare. I used to be so into skincare, but I have just been lazy. So I thought I would go ahead and pull some skincare products uh, with you for next week and until they run out. So let's go ahead and get started. So I thought I would pull some skincare products with you and let you see what I'm planning on incorporating. Not sure how long these will be in my rotation because you know I kind of like to... Once I open a product, I kind of like to use it up before I open up another one. But some of these products, I'm okay with having one or two of them open at the same time. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into today's video. Let's go ahead and start the video. Let's go ahead and start the video with some products that I'm currently using and have been using. And we'll see if any of those can be switched out. Um, this is one product that I've been using, which is the Inky, Inky Liss Oak Cleansing Balm. I am almost out of this. I kind of have to tap it down to get the product out. So I'm almost out of this product. Um, I'm also using the Pharmacy Whip Greens. This is an oil-free foaming cleanser. It has moringa and papaya in it. I received this. Um, and well, I think I bought this from one of the BoxyCharm pop-ups. I also have my Elf Exfoliating Scrub. This is with Purified Water and Vitamin E. Excuse all the makeup on the products. I have my toner by Fresh. It's the Rose Deep Hydration Facial Toner. And for my serum, I have the Dermalect Outcrease Retinol Trifecta Serum. And this did come in one of my Boxy Charms, and I love it. it. To me, it's more like a facial oil. That's what it feels like. But um, I'm, I'm down to here in this product because I use this all the time. Okay, and for moisturizer, I've been using the e.l.f. Holy Hydration Face Cream with Hyaluronic Acid and Peptide Complex. Now, I am almost out of this, especially since I don't have a nighttime moisturizer now. I've emptied it. So, I have this, and as you can probably see, I hope you can see, this is just like a couple more uses, and this is going to be done. So, I do want to pull a new moisturizer for my face. But those, these are the items that I currently have in my rotation. And I do know that I do want to keep the inky list because, like I said, it's almost done. But I want to pull a backup. Okay, so I don't know where we should start. I brought my skincare stuff out. <laughs> Just a lot. Um, but for moisturizers, let's start there. Let's start at moisturizers. Um, I did go ahead and pull the moisturizers that I have. And I really thought I have more, but I don't. Okay, so I do know that I have to pull a moisturizer. And I only have three? And I really thought I had more. Or maybe I've been using them up more than I thought. Uh, one of the moisturizers is inside this Laneige. This is uh, my birthday gift from last year. It came with the Lip Sleeping Mask and Water Bank Moisture Cream and a Water Sleeping Mask. Haven't used any anything in here. I already had one of these that I used up. And this is their Water Sleeping Mask. I've never had that before. But I think I have tried their water bank moisture cream a water sleeping mask and the lips 
lip mask. So let's see. Water sleeping mask. Overnight moisture recharging gel mask with sleep scent. Delivers deep hydration. So you use that at night. Laneige Water Bank Moisture Cream. Okay, so you're supposed to put this evenly on the face before the water sleeping mask. Before this. So this is a dual product. So I think, I, I'm guessing you use both of these at night. And then you put your lip sleeping mask on overnight as well. Okay, that's not bad. Okay, that's up for consideration. And then we have the Glow Recipe Banana Souffle Moisture Cream. And this is what it looks like right here. This is the box that it came in. And have never used um, this before. It says to use as a daily moisturizer after serum, smooth as dime size amount onto clean skin morning and night. So I can use this in the morning and at night time. And then this is the product that I really want to pull. And I think I just made, because I think I've had this next product in my skincare line more than, longer than any of these other two. And let me just see. I don't think this says whether you use it in the daytime or at night. So... That's good. But anyway, the product I'm talking about is the Tatcha the Dewy Silk Cream. And this is their special edition cream. This is uh, whenever you buy this, I think they make a donation to, yeah, it says giving back. Your purchase supports equality through education. So this is what this packaging looks like. And there's a little spill about your donating. And this is what the actual product looks like. And it does have the little spatula up top. Haven't opened this. It says that this is a ultra hydrating and anti-aging replenishing Japanese purple rice for dry skin. And it doesn't say that you have to use it during the day or specifically at night. So I think I would like to add this to my rotation. Can't wait to use this. Um, so yes, let's pull this. So what will I use at night? Will I just use this? My skin has been going not really going through it. I'm being a little dramatic, but because I have been so lax with my skincare, I had noticed last week, maybe two weeks ago, that when I started wearing my makeup again, that um, when I would put my concealer on, I would have a dry patch develop right, right under my eye. And at first, you couldn't see it when you put your concealer on, but um, as time wore on, you would see that uh, dry patch just start coming to the surface. And I know it's because I hadn't done any skincare. So I'm going to use this for my moisturizer. Stick this over here. I do want to continue to use this Dermalact Serum. And I am going to continue on with this um, Cleansing Oat Balm. But... Um, Let's see. This is what I've been kind of doing at night. You know I love my quarterly. You know I love my quarterly products. So I have been using this serum at night by quarterly. And there's plenty left in here. It's only right about right to here. So I do want to incorporate this at night. I finally got a chance to start using this uh, kind of regularly. And love this. This is such a beautiful, rich, emollient moisturizer. And so this is the Vinyl Source Cream Sorbet, um, moisturizing sorbet. And it's very hydrating. Love this. Definitely would purchase this again. So the only thing is, I was going to say I would, I would like to use this as my night cream, but I don't think I have that much in here. 
so that this is not going to last me a long time. But I do want to go ahead and use that first. Um, I'm in, I'm okay with setting aside a, clen a cleanser, a facial cleanser. <laughs> I'm okay with opening one and having another one open. So I'm going to set this one aside. And I think I will try, this is another gel product. You guys know I'm not fond of gel products, but I haven't used this, I think, but maybe once. So this is the Caudalie Purifying Gel Cleanser. So I think I'll try this. And actually, this is another serum. So looks like this is the Vinyl Perfect. And this is, um, this one says just Vinyl, Vinyl Pure Skin Perfecting Serum. So this is also, this is a radiant one. And I guess this is just a regular one. So it looks like I have enough in here for at least a week. And so I think I'll just make, put both of these in here because I do want to empty my Caudalie products because I've had them a long time, but I don't want to empty them because I really love them, but I don't want them to go bad. So I'm going to put all of these in the cleanser, the moisturizer, and the two serums to go along with my Tatcha. And yeah, I'm going to do that. So I'm gonna set these over here. Okay, so now let's look for, do I have anything? Oh, let's start here too. I have some skincare mask. Yeah, I have all my skincare mask in here, which I haven't been doing any mask. And I do wanna to try to do a skincare mask today. Since it's Sunday, I have time. And I do have this, Tatcha one. This is the Luminous Dewy Skin Mask. I have this Tatcha one. Um, oh, I may want to use this Fermi mask. That might be a good one. Here's my sexy leopard that Leanna gave me. <laughs> I didn't use it yet. Um, let me see. Oh, I think I might want to use this one. It says Nourish Flower Nectar. And this is biodegradable. It's a sheet mask and echo pouch made with multi-peptides, ceramides, probiotics, and flower extracts. This is what it looks like. And I do remember getting this um, in my trend mood, maybe. Um, yeah, I think I may want to use this one. It says you leave it on for 20 minutes. Yes, let's try this one. I'm going to pull this one for today. And I'm going to do another one at the end of the week. Now, you guys, um, the Neutrogena, I think it's the Hydro Boost face mask, is an excellent face mask. I've already, I have bought one to try, and I did it on, on a short, a YouTube short, and several months ago. So if you're interested, check out my YouTube short. It was, it was on a mask Monday and that skincare mask is wonderful. It's very hydrating and I loved it. I only brought one and I wish I had another one, which I probably will pick up another one because I really like that one. And okay, so I'm going to pull one sheet mask. I got a feeling, you know, I can talk about skincare all day, but I don't want this video to be too long and I'm, I know it's headed in that direction. I know this is open. I've used this. So I'm going to do, for my second mask for the week, I am going to do this Glam Glow Super Mud Clearing Treatment Mask. I've used this before, so I know it's open. So I'll go ahead and jump back into this mask. And I'll use this one as well as a sheet mask. Now, I don't, I'm going to take away my, oh, if I run out of my, um, the Inkyless Oat Milk Cleansing Balm. I do have this Pharmacy Green Clean Cleansing Balm that I absolutely love. It says it's a Makeup Melt Away Cleansing Balm. I've used this before, 
And you guys, I really like this a lot. It's expensive though. This is expensive. Not this size, but it's expensive. So if I run out of this, because like I said, I'm having to tap it down to use, I'm going to incorporate the Pharmacy Green Clean Melt Away. I also want to use... I also want to use, um, I have some of these eye gels. And this is by Grace and Stella. It says it's like an energy energy drink, drink for your eyes. I have those. I haven't used those. But I did get some eye patches one time, you guys, and they were dry as a bone. I couldn't use them. I had to throw them away. So now I'm trying not to leave these kinds of products for too long. So I did get these that I have been dying to try. This is by Gen Skin. And I told you how I developed that um, dry patch underneath. So I do want to try this. It it's, um, comes with a little tool up top to get the little eye gels out. And you just put them on and just let it do its thing. Haven't tried these, haven't used anything like this, but I've always wanted to. So today... I think I'm going to use some of these little eye patches in an attempt to help my under eye. I'll use that with my sheet mask or after my sheet mask. So I'll use that. And I also have a eye cream that I really love. I really like it a lot. So I definitely want to incorporate that. Oh, here it is. It is by belief. Now the rubbing, the writing has rubbed off. So I don't know what it's called, but it is a belief eye cream. Love this stuff. And I have really been using it a lot, but not lately. So I do want to go ahead and put this back into my nighttime, daytime routine. Um, just so I can try to, you know, help my eye situation as best as I can. Um, this is a new eye cream to me. I haven't used this. This is the Triple Algae Eye Renewal Balm by Aldrinus. It says it reduces the look of dark circles. I haven't used this at all. Love the bottle though. I haven't used this at all. I'm going to take you guys down just so you can help me see if I'm missing anything. Okay, this is, you know, some of my skincare right here. Um, I think I have every, oh, we didn't get a, a exfoliating scrub. I don't think this is that. I think I have a, yes, I have a Kate exfoli exfoliate, and I don't think I've ever used this. Let's set this to the side and see if I have anything else. Oh, I do want to use this Tatcha, not Tatcha, but this um, Tata Harper. This is a cleanser. Haven't used this before. What's this? Oh, this is the Magic Cream by Charlotte Tilbury. Maracuja oil. Oh, here's a toner. Um, I don't want to switch. I've used this toner before and it's open. Let's switch out and put this toner in our rotation. And then we can just put this one by Fresh back. This is an eye cream, sleepy mask, lip sleepy mask. Two. Um, oh, I do want to try this. Um, this is a liquid collagen. I just don't know how I would incorporate this. Maybe I could just use this in the morning. I don't know what it says though. It says. Apply after cleansing and toning. Apply to the 
entire face and neck and decollete. For optimal results, follow with moisturizer. Okay, see, I don't tone usually in the morning, so I tone at night. I don't care. I'm going to try it. I want to try this. I was intrigued when I purchased it. It kept going in and out of stock. Okay, this is what it looks like. Yeah, I think I want to try this. And it's so pretty. Yeah, let's try this. We'll just try to incorporate it in the morning. And I think this is it. I do have a couple of moisturizers, little tiny ones. Oh, this isn't one, though. What is this? I have some stuff in here that I'm kind of afraid of, y'all. Never tried it before. Okay, so I think I'm just going to stick with the Kate Somerville Exfoliate for my exfoliator. Now, remember, I got this from my Trend Mood box. And I haven't used any of it because I'm not really sure about these products. <laughs> Let me take them out. Okay, so I took all these products out. And I remember I got the skincare brush, which I'll use with my mask. Put that over there and let's see there's some oh yeah and I got the skincare little headband so I'll use that but now there's some heavy hitters here that I'm just not really comfortable with um this one is the renew serum I'm not I don't really have a problem with that um this right here what is this? Um, retinol plus C pill boost. I don't know about the pill. And then this one right here is a Hydro Bright Pro 5 liquid ex exfoliant. I don't know, guys. This is like some heavy duty stuff. And then right here we have a barrier balm. For this is for the lips. That's fine. And this one is a glycolic resurfacing cleanser. And this is their gentle clean cleanser. So some of these are okay. It's just, I think, mainly um, these two products. <laughs> that I'm, I mean, they, that seems real medical grade to me. So I'm not sure about that. So I'm going to put those back in the pouch for now. Oh, and I did find this, um, this tart. This is Wink H2O. And this is an eye cream, but we already pulled our eye cream. So this is all I'm going to pull from this basket right here. Okay, now I still have this basket here. Cannot wait to use this Tatcha rice water. Um, the rice wash. I really can't wait to use that. Here we have another serum. This is by Glow Recipe. I have another cleanser. This is the Watermelon Charcoal Purifying Cleanser by Pure Lease. And I know I'm going to have to start incorporating some of these. Some of these may be pretty good products. This is their advanced serum with vitamin E and hyaluronic acid. So this is a serum. I have a lot of serums. Okay, this is what this looks like. Okay, I think I have enough serums for now. Oh, I do want to somehow, some way start using this Murad Retinol Youth Renewal Serum. Another serum. Haven't used that. I remember when I got this. This is a plumping lip and eye serum. 
<laughs> by True Plus Luscious. And, oh, here's another product by Pharmacy. Um, this is their facial oil. So I don't think I need a facial oil with all these serums going on. I don't want to be so, so glowy. But I can't wait to actually use this. The packaging looks so cute. Let's see if I can get it out. Here we go. So yeah, I'm gonna, maybe my next go around, I'll pull a facial oil. Oh, and I think these two products right here were also a part of the Trend Mood. Maybe they were. I think they were also a part of that Trend Mood bag. And this is the Glow Bio Renew EGF Drops. It says it's an epidermal growth factor cell repair and serum. And then we have the um, Glow Anti-Stress CBD Drops. And this is a serum as well. So we have both of those. Do I have anything else in here that I want to use? There's another eye cream. Um, super cleanse. Clearing cream. Full me cleanser. Okay, this is another cleanser. We have our Dr. Brandt. Oh, I could have pulled one of these exfoliators. And this is a serum that I have, have used before. And then we have the vacuum cleaner pore purifying mask by dr brant um i'm not seeing anything else i want here's another hibiscus unspottable correcting oil it's another oil oh and this is by georgette cleaner i just used her primer a couple of weeks back this is a vitamin c mask huh how do you use this? How do you use it though? Apply mask after cleansing and toning your skin. Is it all? Oh, okay. So you just pump it out. Okay. Forgot I had that. So I'll probably incorporate that sooner than later. Here's another product by Algernus. Oh, we talked about that. This, this is the eye renewal balm i think we talked about yeah we talked about that and here's a uh, eye cream by elf i've used this before and here's their melt away cleansing balm oh and i do have i do have these two products that i haven't used that i want to and these are by fenty skin this is their fat water toner. And this is their cleanser. I haven't used any products by Fenty. And I think the only other thing really are some more. I've used these. That's Incredipil. Ooh. I've used these before. I remember when I used this in a video. It's, it was stinging. Stinging my eyes. And then I've used this before also. This is by First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream. And then I think we have another toner by a car. So that's all that's in here. So I don't think I need anything else from there. I guess I guess that's it then. Okay, let me put you guys back up. Okay, so just a roundup of what I selected. I forgot to share with you guys. I do have the Garnier um, Skin Active Micellar Cleansing Water. I first brought this when, maybe two years ago, when we had the horrific snowstorm here. And people didn't have water. You know, we were having to put um, snow in the buckets in case the water went out. And so I went ahead and picked this up. I heard Monique from Monique's Makeup talking about this. So... 
I went ahead and picked it up and now I just generally use it to just take off my eye makeup. So I'm gonna keep that. Um, I, did I say I was gonna use this? I guess I should have it because I'm sure I'm gonna empty. So we're gonna use this except for we're not gonna be, we're not gonna use this lip sleepy mask because um, I already have some other lip sleepy masks that I've already opened. And actually, I do want to continue on with, this is not a lip sleepy mask, but I still want to use it. I'm still trying to empty this a car. And I made really good progress on it. And it feels so good on the lips. So I'm going to use just continue on with this. Okay, so we'll use the other two items in here from Laneige. So we're we're going to forgot what they were already. Okay, so we're this is the Laneige Water Bank Moisture Cream. I'm gonna speed it up. And then we have the Laneige Water Sleeping Mask. So I'm supposed to use the mask first and then this um, moisturizer. So I'm gonna use these at night. And then I'm going to use the Tatcha Dewey uh, Skin Cream. Can't wait. I'm going to use this during the day. Sometimes I may use it at night. Um, I'm going to rotate this in in the morning. The Alginus um, Liquid Collagen. So I'm going to incorporate this. And on the nights that I'm going to exfoliate, I'm going to use my Kate Somerville Exfoli Kate. It says it's an intensive exfoliating treatment. So we're going to put this in our rotation. Um, I have the belief, and I'll have to pop it up on the screen what the name is, but I do like this a lot. This is the eye cream that I'll be using. I'm gonna continue on with my Holy Hydration Face Cream because like I said, I'm almost out of this and when I do, then I'm gonna pick up the Tatcha um, Dewy Skin Cream. Um, also, I'm going to continue on with my, the Inky List Oat Cleansing Balm. Almost out of this, when I, when I do finish it, I'm picking up the Pharmacy Green Clean Makeup Melt Away Cleansing Balm. So I have that. I'm also going to continue on with my Dermalect Out Crease Retinol Trifecta Serum. Going to continue on with this. For my toner, we put back the Rose Deep Hydration Facial Toner by Fresh. And we're going to pick up the uh, Mamonde, Mamonde Rose Water Toner. Um, I have a sheet mask that I'm going to use, the Flower Nectar Sheet Mask. And I also have the Glam Glow um, Super Mud Clearing Treatment Mask. I'm going to use this. And then also I picked up these products, again, by Caudalie. Love, love, love. I'm going to be using these. I don't know how long these are going to last me, like I said. Um, I know I have plenty of the cleanser in here. This moisturizer is so good. And I've, I have used this uh, serum. So it sounds like I have plenty in here too. But I also have this serum to go with it. And of course, I'm going to be using my Gen Skin um, Hydrating Marine Algae Eye Patches. Can't wait to use those. And I think that's it, you guys. And I'm going to be using my fancy mask brush and my Glow Skin Beauty headband. So now let me just say, I'm not using these just for a week. You know, I, I don't typically do that with my skincare. Um, I'm going to be using a lot of these products until they empty out. Um, like I said, there's some products I can play around with, such as, you know, uh, facial cleansers. I don't mind having one or two open at the same time. Um, exfoliating 
things, yes, but um, like these serums and moisturizers. I don't want to start a moisturizer and then put it back and have it open and then go to another moisturizer. So I'm going to use, I'm going to be using these for a while. So these types of videos will not come to you often. Only when I find that I'm running low on products or have used them up, then I might pop back in with those same products, but I just will replace those that have gone, that I have emptied. Okay, so this is a different kind of video. This is my skincare basket for the upcoming weeks. <laughs> that's what this video is all about. So I think that's everything. I think I have everything that I want to use for the next few weeks. So if you did enjoy today's video, please consider subscribing to my channel, giving this video a thumbs up, and ringing the notification bell. It just lets you know each and every time that I upload a video and share the channel because you know I don't mind. And lastly, please know that you're always welcomed and wanted here on my channel. And with that said, thank you guys so much for tuning in to today's video. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everybody, and have a great day. Bye-bye.